M0FXB, welcome to my channel and please uh, subscribe and like if you find this information useful. So I just saw this announced on Facebook, believe it or not, um, the AH730 antenna tuner. So I'm guessing they've used the 730 in line with the ICOM 7300, which is a 100 watt tuner. So what does it say here? Fast tune up from 1.8 to 50 megahertz band remote control with ICOM transceivers and we'll just click on the, the larger image so they've made um, very similar looking tuners before it's not a new thing let's have a quick look here and then look if you scroll down through you can see a couple of here tuners different models but you get the idea similar uh, design type so let's roll down it's wide frequency coverage with a 7 meter or 23 foot long wire element all band matching is possible from 1.8 to 160 megahertz band to the 50 megahertz band high speed tuning uh, minimum rf output for tuning so 0.3 watts and it'll kick in which is good um, and then ipx4 water resistant and then more information here maximum power 150 watts PEP or 100 watts continuous tunable bands there it's got memories tuner accuracy the size the weight current drain 0.7 amps temperature there IP rating IPX4 compatible products let that boot there you go it's all the hate basically it's all the ICOM HF 100 watt radios looking at this HF 6 meters so that's expected and then they've got something here combinations and different things available and there's the cable the opc 1465 that powers it so and it's a shielded cable so yeah all seems fine to me looks like they've you know they've brought out a new or a, mo a new current version of this tuner now if it's been out a while let me know i've actually looked around to see what the cost is of buying this item and I can't find it even listed at the moment. Um, so I'm guessing it's four to five hundred pound for something like this. That is my guess. So let me know more IPX4. So thanks for watching my video. Please like and subscribe. Let me know. Do you prefer these sort of these type tuners? Um, I think they're quite common. They're mounted outside or just inside the shack uh, near the exit point as the feed line goes outside because look if you think the cable the, the long wire looks like it connects here so I'm guessing this is an outdoor outdoor tuner isn't it your power feed here and that's where you plug in your your radio so 73 thanks for watching all the best please like and subscribe my channel if you haven't already 73